Hello everybody and welcome back to City Skylines! I'm Stranky and um, what have we got? We've got a beautiful thingy majiggy. Alright, brilliant. So yes, we've been working on this new area here and um, power is okay, water is okay, rubbish is pretty good. I mean we're emptying our landfills at an alarming rate. They're probably almost empty now. Um, if I was to close off that. You are emptying finished. There we go. Um, stop emptying. And you are 3% full. We can stop emptying. So you can accept rubbish. So we can start filling up again. We can process some rubbish in this recycling plant, which is pretty good. We can burn in these. So this is going to be a like major polluty area. And, uh, what's wrong here? Not enough workers. That's not good. Not enough traffic lights apparently. Have to keep an eye on that traffic. This is. I'm guessing these are parked cars. Yes, parked. Makes it look like there's a traffic jam. I don't know who parks on the roundabout, but where I come from, you do that, you'll have your car towed. And you'll have a nice big bill from the DMV. Um, so, what are we going to do today? I think we could continue expanding out here. We've got quite a demand. We put down some residential stuff in the last episode here, which seems to be... Going up, I mean, people are happy, they're, they're expanding, but um, we're not getting too many people actually in the city, so we'll put these actually down like, like that, and then we'll see how we can fill them out, or how best to fill them out, rather. We'll do a th three like that. We can do uh, something like that. So we will fill them up, it's just I like to get my 4x4s down first. That's being built now so we can get that. Um, I'm going to choose you. Something like that. Let me try and put that one down. And once these build we'll just fill in those last few bits and bobs. So how is everyone for medicine? You should be okay. I mean, we've got a clinic right there. We've got... Yeah, how about this? There's no coverage here. Maybe I should put one here just to uh, keep everyone happy. Maybe we could put a sauna there. Maybe they'll go there and break or something. I don't know. Fire! Fire is a bit of a concern. We'll do that there to keep everyone happy. They're gonna go blue. Police. It's doing okay. But I think I'm gonna put a police station here just to keep everyone even happier. We're making enough money, so it's all good. Education. We have a high school down here. I don't know why they're not getting there. Elementary school. Again, we have one there. Is it full up, possibly? Let's see. You are half full. Maybe they just haven't got there yet. We'll have to, again, gauge what's going on with them and um, do things accordingly. So anyway, let's continue down here with some more, I think, commercial. 
we're going to do another row. We'll start from here. So we'll put them down. I've done that wrong. Put them down like so. So then we can um, see what we do there. I think that it's like there's one extra line next to the fire station. Yeah, there's one one line. Maybe I can get that little park. It might help cheer people up. Get that now. So that should be good. And then we'll get. Opposite going on along here. So this particular one is going to be blue and blue, or blue being commercial. So commercial each side. So a whole block of commercial. So all. Then obviously we'll fill it up as they build. Build in, we'll fill it right up. Uh, they should all have water. Passed it all in the last episode. And um, they should also get electric, no problem. But obviously, we need to just let them build in. Uh, the industrial demand is down, so I'm thinking probably we'll do a little bit of residential in this this box here. Problem is doing residential in this area because we don't have any services for them whereas here we do have services so we'll need to give them schools and clinics and all sorts but I mean I guess we were gonna have to do something so if we do it in the middle we could do all green here try and put as many services in this sort of middle block do some more green here and then continue with offices and commercial out here. I think that's what we'll do. So we'll bring them in like so. Because we're getting that, that demand again. And, um, and I'm only going on the slow speed again because once we started making mega bucks, we. Um, we don't need to go on the fastest speed. It gets a little bit, I wouldn't say overwhelming. Someone's upgrading already. They've moved in and they're upgrading, so we're doing something right. But it's a little bit... Um, like, if things go wrong, they go wrong too quickly. You can't like pay attention to every aspect of the city if you're running at maximum speed all the time. And, um, for me at least, I think it's better to uh, take things nice and slow when possible and uh, let let the, the city grow organically. Well, we're not letting it grow organically, we're telling it how to grow. But we're, we're acting a bit like a planning authority, saying, no, oh, you have to build this side building in this plot land. So, what I mean is, the, um, that, put those down. The the demand. That's what I mean. Not the organic growing. So I mean, they're getting all those things. So let's start putting them down some surfaces. So. We're gonna want. We're gonna need garbage at some point. But maybe. We bring something. So we've got that road here. Because all our garbage is right up the very top. So if we bring this road. Here. Right, that's gonna bugger that one slightly. Let's just try and fix 
that. Now if we can put something It would look. See how the green fills out if we put one there? Let's put one there. That will send its trucks out to that whole area. Because we've got to have it not being covered. Right, so that does the rubbish. So they should be happy with that. So, medical clinic. We'll do it. We'll do it smack dab in the middle. And we'll do a thingy next to it. Then what we'll do, we'll do a fire station. We've got one there, but we can bring another one here. Well, I mean, we're making the money, so that's okay. Police station, we'll do it next to there. Then these bits in the middle, we can fill up with some trees. School, yes, they're definitely gonna need a school. So we'll give them a high, uh, elementary school and next door they'll have a high school so they can have all of the education they need and then transport we're really gonna have to look into the transport for this area but anyway there's something I don't really <laughs> feel like doing at the moment that's why I keep saying we'll look into it Meaning, I don't want to do that right now, but we do have to do it eventually. So, yeah, fit to exact, that's good. Now, this will work from this corner, like so. Right, sorry about that, I had a phone call, and we can continue putting things in because obviously, we got things built while I was on the phone. So the phone call ended up being a good thing. So we'll put these down like so. Now, I'll work from this corner. So then we'll sort of fill in the gaps when we, uh, when we get there. It would be like that. That would be like that. Will be a four so then this one will be a two that's what I meant by filling in the gaps so we'll probably have two three by threes but we'll let those build and then um, then we'll fill fill them up that will be like that that will be like that could probably put a little park there there's our little one by four I don't think these actually... Well, it has a bit of a green area, but not too much. We can put one of our thingies down there. That will help. I'll fit one there. I fit one. I fit one there. I should cheer everyone up in this area. To get people as, as, as happy as possible. So we'll do that. We'll go back to the zoning. That is more or less built. So we'll fill up those. We'll do that one. And then we'll see where we need to put some trees. If we need to put any trees, I think we need to put some in this area. We'll do It's been moved, yeah, moved to landscaping. I have to get used to this. Should we do some palm trees? It's a small one. Quite nice. Give it a little bit of a different thing. I mean, these sort of like adding these should help, really, but they don't. But it should help with the aesthetic of the area. 
because even like having the trees in the road, it should help, but it doesn't. That's okay. So if I was to live in a street that had palm trees down, down, down it, well, it's not really in the street, but like nearby, like around the back of the, uh, the local clinic and the police station, or is it a fire station? I think that's the fire station. But yeah, if if they had like a few palm trees down the back, it would be like, yeah, it's a nice, nice little area that they're done for that police station. I think that's how people would think, but I mean, maybe it wouldn't be as effective as a park, obviously, because park is a park, but but yeah, we'll put some trees down here as well. And what I want to mess around with as well is the little. Put some palm trees down like that. It's a nice little area we've done. I mean, it's going to be quite dense, but it's um, got all the, the the needs sorted as well for the area. So that should that should be quite good for everyone. We've still got a huge residential demand, so we can probably continue with another block, at least one more block of residential, which makes sense once we have these here to continue like a, a residential center so um, so people can sort of have access to all those because if we were to do two more or three of that and then do a residential over here then there would be no access to what we've just put down so yeah more residential here seems to be what we need and what we can do so we'll put that down obviously be at our full density so we'll have even more people in this little bit I think we did good did well did good we did well with that that little area there I think it will pay dividends once obviously all of these are up. We're making good profit. I mean we went down from where we were on about 12k per tick. I don't know what the tick is. Is it per month? Week a week. It's going down again, but once everyone's moving in, should bounce back up. Probably some factories and stuff are closing up there, which could be causing a little bit of an issue. But that shouldn't be too much of an issue. So we've got everything we need down here. Now we can put a few more commercials because everything's built up there. So we'll put them down. Not sure what those high density commercials would be in real life. So, one thing I want to do is this landscaping. I was just saying, there's the um, new um, water things, there's a key, there's the uh, flood wall, the shadow canals, medium canals, and deep canals. I don't quite know if what they do if they're purely aesthetic or if they do something in the game so we want to try something out maybe we can do something in in this area here with them joining up those or something we'll have to see or maybe we can join up that to that when we buy this bit of land make a canal going down but I don't want to 
bring, like do that, that will then bring all the poop to this area. So we'll have to see what we do. Or maybe we can chop chop a bit off of here or something like that. We'll see what, what, what happens and how it affects people. Maybe it has something to do with um, like living near the water, so you can bring the water in to increase land value or something like that. We'll have to we'll have to have a look at it and play with it. So anyway, we'll continue with our I think everything yeah everything there has been built up. So put them all put them all down. And we've got flashing lights on the top. Is it, is it just a that means it's quite high and we'll need an airport at some point as well so we'll sort of start planning where should we put our airport hmm let's actually go into this view so right now we have this so if we I want to expand down here we bought that bit we haven't done anything with it as such I mean, apart from our power station, but maybe we could put another one up here. I'm not sure, but I'm thinking we should. I mean, definitely these two and and this one here would be nice to also build across. So I want to see what we'll be doing next. Possibly continuing down with the main. I mean, bit of the city and then this would be like a separate part so um, yeah let's, let's actually let's purchase you know, I think we have the money to purchase everything don't we I don't think it costs more taxes okay so we've got the maximum tiles I think for the amount of people we have um, I think I have the mod on to unlock all tiles but I hope I do. But now we can work on... What am I doing? I've got all the keys around. Sitting here in the dark again. We can work on this junction here. See what, what we're going to do. So probably we'll have this going up like we did there. And then do on and off ramps. Because we've got look, yeah, we've got look, we've got a tail back there, so that's not good. So yeah, we'll work on that. I think in the next episode, I have no idea how long this episode has gone on for, but I think we're probably about there. I don't know if it's a shorter episode. If it is a shorter episode, I do apologise, but I think we've done done quite good doing this whole residential bit here. And um, yeah, every episode, as long as we make progress and um, oh, we can be happy with it. But, yeah, that, that little thing, I'm not too happy with that. We'll probably have to move that at some point. Maybe we can move it down the bottom here. Anyway, yes, thanks for watching. I've been Stranky. This has been City Skylines. Don't forget to let me know if you want to be named in any of these if you're watching this series and um, if you're a subscriber I'll be more than happy to name a district after you anyway until next time thanks for watching and bye bye